guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Emily Lucy Wretch. I hope you are doing well. Today's video is a Zara one. I haven't done a Zara one since the start of autumn. So as all the nice little festive Christmassy bits are coming in to store and online, I wanted to pick some of my favourites because I know how much you guys also love Zara. Actually going on the website, you need a degree to try and decipher what looks good. So instead of you wasting your money, I thought I would be your guinea pig, try some of the bits on that are on there at the moment and see what we think together. Quite a few of these bits I'm going to share with you today are black or dark shades but i feel like at this time of year having a nice lbd is so important accessorize it in different ways you know just tweak it to be something a little bit more special than it is but then you can get it back out over the christmas period or even throughout winter spring summer you can always have a good lbd in your dress no matter what the occasion so i've gone for this one i'll put it on screen here the code and what the item is this one i've got in a size large and it is a really simple dress i'm loving it at the moment like a bodycon style dress and putting my skims underneath it i feel like it just mm, gives me the shape that i'm wanting by putting the skims underneath and i just think it looks just so simple and classy so i'm going to try that one on for you now this one as i said is in a size large and the quality of the fabric feels really nice i've linked everything down below if you wanted to shop any of these items but i'm so sorry if they are sold out you know what zara is like it is actually a nightmare to get things in stock so i do know on some of the items if they are coming back in stock they'll have an email underneath saying get a back in stock email so if it is coming back it should have that so i do apologize if any of these bits are out of stock but you know it's that time of year when everyone is shopping so just wanted to show some of my favorite bits okay number one already zara delivering like i just can't i don't think they can be beaten like every single time i think there's no way that's gonna look good it, it just does i don't know what it is i don't know if it's the cut of things or the fabric or just the elegance of a lot of the items that zara create i just love like even these sleeves are long which on any other dress i'd be like oh like it's just not made for my shape or like ah, arm length but i actually think it's on purpose like i actually like how elegant and delicate it makes the dress I'll just show you it full length here. Like, I am wearing shapewear underneath. I've just got like a, it's actually from ISO at first. It's just a really simple leotard. I do also have skims that I wear quite a lot and I feel like the skims definitely gives a lot more structure and shape to my body rather than this is just like a generic shapewear body. But I've purposely put this one on because my skims come to here so you would see it. So it is quite a high slit, whereas this one's just like a standard bodysuit. But skims also do do the bodysuit. So I'll link both down below depending on what your budget is but i saw it first as delivering in this one honestly like it's literally sucking me in in all the right places i can definitely feel more structured here and i don't think i would feel as comfortable in this dress if i didn't have that on both are working together love this neckline to start with i was like what's going on like why is this covered but i just think wow so delicate elegant beautiful for a black tie event this dress as well like you know my biggest bugbear is wearing something that's a statement and then you never wear it again i feel like this is a really classic black dress that you would be able to wear again the length on me i wish it was a little bit longer or a little bit shorter because i'm five foot two i feel like it just hits me right on the ankle um which from on is just all feet if that makes sense but the shape like the little bit of ruching here i just i can imagine having like a clip or something there and then my hair like and a bit like hollywood you know but i also quite like it with the kim vibe with the long hair and quite minimal number one she's staying i like her a lot next i am still feeling brown i am in the autumn vibe still i know that we're very close to christmas and i love all the festive sparkles i did loads for my brand ela style which you can see here we did a full christmas style campaign where you can multi-wear things in different ways and again i'll add a link down at the bottom if you want to shop any of those items however i am still feeling autumnal with the browns i just love the shade brown i'm like a bit biased because everyone always says how much brown really complements my skin tone so ever since then i'm just like give me more of this shade i just love it so much i have picked up this little simple roll neck to go with a brown skirt we also have loads of nice little brown bits coming back in stock from ELR style the t-shirt which is linked down below is one of my favorites super flattering so have a look at that and um, but i also wanted to try this roll neck with this skirt so you guys might remember from last year i shared with you a zara black leather skirt so many of you loved it so many of you bought it probably some of you are here from that video alone because loads of people loved that zara haul um so i picked it up in brown 
on and I'm really excited to try it on as a look with this because I feel like this is giving me Christmas events. I've got my worst Christmas party coming up but we're going to go for a daytime situation so I just wanted to do maybe like a casual but smart casual vibes or going to London in a few weeks and I want to do the same. I want to be able to like wear something that's comfortable and warm with like a nice heeled boot but I'm not in you know stiletto platform kind of vibe. Then I feel like this is just a really nice way to give that glam look by putting two similar colours together and making it in such a statement. So I'm going to try that on for you now. The skirt I got in a large and the top in a medium. I was expecting to love this more. I hate the top. The top is trash. Do not buy this top. It feels awful. The shape of it is awful. It's unflattering. The colours are awful. It's like a grey brown. The skirt I do love. It's giving all the flattering vibes that the black one did. It's actually slightly different to the black one actually. When I've got it on it's completely different actually. The front is different but this is like way more innovative and flattering on the stomach area. I do want to keep the skirt. I'll probably wear it with the brown t-shirt that I've got from your last style or we are going to be launching the brown Helena so that'll look really nice and stuff like that. But I'm just thinking how many times will I actually wear this skirt? I don't think I will. I think I'll maybe like wear it once or twice as a statement. Whereas I got recently some brown trousers from Simply Be and the fit and quality of them was lovely and I can imagine wearing those with trainers and boots and heels in different ways and I'm going to get a lot more wear out of those trousers than I will this skirt. I feel like this skirt's like a bit of a one hit wonder. I do like it and if you are somebody who loves brown get this skirt. It is really really beautiful. It fits so nicely but talking about me it will sit in my wardrobe so it's going to go back. I also picked up this in brown, which I was going to put with the skirt, but as it has arrived, it is completely sheer. Like, I didn't think that's what it was on the website because this neckline, I'm not really sure how you're supposed to put a bra with it because it's kind of like this neckline. So I'm a little bit confused with this one, to be honest. I'll add a picture here of what it looked like when I bought it on the website, but it's not what I thought. It's in an XL, so I think it's way too big for me as well. So I'm actually not even going to try this on. It's a complete no, because look, it is literally full-blown, transparent. Then I've gone a little bit wild. I've never tried anything like this before, so this could look absolutely grotesque, but this is why I do these videos. So I try them, so you don't have to if it looks awful, or as we have been pleasantly surprised so many times on this channel by trying new things, it might look absolutely radiant. I have gone for these trousers, so I did actually do a Zara haul. Not that long ago but I didn't actually do it as a YouTube video so I actually shopped this suit to again put with my ELR style bits because all of the pieces from ELR style are body suits that you can wear in multiple different ways so obviously they work really well with trousers, skirts, suits, anything like that they work really really well with. I did want to try and get these trousers instead of them in green in black but as I was putting the basket through I was literally ready to click send they said it sold out and I was like what they were in my basket literally three seconds ago what's happened so instead I had to go for these which I can already see I'm not gonna like as much because they don't have the same waistband or style but I'm gonna be positive so these ones are in a size large and I have got them to try with wildcard this top yes that is a boob tube Basque, strapless, whatever you want to call it. I'm as shocked as you guys because I just thought, you know what? It's giving peplum vibes without being a peplum, which is very flattering on the lower tum. However, now it's come, I'm not sure. I, like I said, I'm going to be optimistic. If it's tight on the bust here and then a little bit loose here and then I've got these flared trousers on, it might actually be a hit and we're like, wow, unusual, but we like it. I'm going to try it on for you now. Like I said, trousers are in a size large and the top is in a size large too. I'm also loving at the moment Zara jewellery. The statement necklace is back. I'm so for it. I remember when I was personal shopping at Topshop 2010 maybe? 2011? Can't remember. Something around that. Oxford Street personal shopping for Topshop. We used to have the Freedom jewellery stand and I loved nothing more than teaming some statement necklaces up for glam at Christmas parties with all of the Topshop looks. Sadly Topshop has gone. I don't know if Freedom's still around. Um, if it is even called that anymore. But... Zara are bringing them back. We have some amazing statement jewellery. I actually picked up this one last time that I've been wearing loads in my videos on Instagram and TikTok and shorts. And then now I've picked up this. I thought it is so pretty the way that it's like 
a choker, but it's not like a set choker like Kim Paris Hilton in 2006. I'm actually gonna try it on with the look I've just showed you. Let me try that on. Number one, I'm filming here on my own, so I cannot zip this up from the back. So it's not a true representation because I cannot physically zip it up myself. So we need help to get into this outfit. I feel like we're already not properly zipping up. Do you know what I mean? So it's a no. But I can see the vision. Can you guys see the vision? If this was like tight, so it'd be like this. I can see what I'm trying to do. No, it's giving me Spice Girls. I can be wearing something like this to my school disco at 13. It's no, 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 no. You guys might like it and it will look so much better on you, but for my body shape, it's a no. I had really high hopes. Then next, again, like I said about the ELR bodysuits, I love to buy things that go with the bodysuits because then you can really transform the outfits in different ways. You're not just stuck with one dress that you can wear and everyone's seen you in that dress. When you shop the bodysuits, then you can really change the outfit for whatever the occasion is, whether it's work, whether it's Christmas party, whether it's taking your dog for a walk, going shopping. You can really use those bodysuits to create versatile outfits with. But obviously with that, you need things to do that with um, to mix and match. So I have gone for two things from Zara. One being this skirt. So I do love all of the kind of ruching and not skirts that Zara do. I feel like they are so good and they last a long time. They're really high quality. Got that one in a size large and it's only $17.99. So I'm going to try that one on with a bodysuit. So I have got the skirt on now and I feel like the skirt is the exact same shape as the first dress that I tried on. So if you're somebody like me who likes to team bodysuits up with skirts rather than buying the dress like at the start, obviously the dress was beautiful i loved it but now try the skirt on i'm thinking why don't i just put a charlotte bodysuit or a bodysuit like i've got on now with this skirt and then i can just reinvent that dress over and over again with in different ways so i'm thinking i'm showing you with this t-shirt now because this looks great for like a work or if you wanted something a bit more smart casual somebody who works in an office but you want to still look smart then this skirt also works for that but then you could also just change it I'm just literally improvising here guys and go for one of our other bodysuits that have got no sleeves and instantly it's a lot more dressier and then you've got a completely different outfit again and if you're somebody who struggles with how to put these outfits together then I do actually have a video on how to dress basics and make them work in different ways which this skirt would fit perfectly in that video again I'll link it down below if you wanted to watch that after this video but yes this skirt is staying fit is perfect love it it's so so nice like it's just a really good buy and much better value for money compared to the dress i showed you at the start of this video i really got into the dress like i was like god i really love this it's making me feel good but then i know for a fact it will sit in my wardrobe i've already got a zara dress very similar to that that i did for a haul i didn't actually end up trying it on in the haul but i kept it because i thought i'm gonna try that on and wear it one day I've still even tried it on it as in my wardrobe, so I want to talk myself into sense and talk sense into you at the same time. In the fact that buying two different pieces, I personally find, is so much better for the environment, better for your wallet, and also will help you build outfits and learn how to dress for different occasions, rather than just bringing the same dress out every single time. So, skirt, number one hit of this haul. I love it so much, it's super flattering. Love the ruching, love the material, love the price. Sold, makes your bum look great too. And then I've picked up these jeans. These are a 44, I think that's a 16. I saw this thing the other day on TikTok, I'm gonna try it. So basically, if you put the jeans around your neck, it'll say if it's gonna fit around your waist or not. I look crazy right now, but they're touching. So I feel like my waist might get in them. They are a really nice thick denim and I just loved the look of these online because I do need a really good pair of blue jeans to put with some of my more festive looks. I feel like nothing looks nicer than a bodysuit, pair of jeans and a blazer with a nice statement necklace and bag over the Christmas period. Or if you are one of those people who just have no plans but then somebody calls you up and is like, get an outfit together quickly, we're going out and you like to be spontaneous, then a good pair of light wash mum style jeans from Zara are your best friend. They're called the Comfort Mum Fit size, 44 euro. And I'm gonna try them on again with a bodysuit. So let's hope that these fit. So I am wearing the jeans right now. As you can see, I tried them on 
just with some shapewear to start with. They are really flattering. They're a weird shape. Like, are they? I don't know. I can't describe how they fit. They fit really well, but I don't know if this is how they're supposed to fit. Because I've got some real thighs. So I'm thinking, should they be like more loose on the leg? But I actually really like them. I did try to wear them in a casual way. I tried them on with my Air Force. And I also tried them on with flat boots. They just, no. Definitely cannot be worn with flats, in my opinion. They just look so much better with a heel, which is how I've dressed them up now. So I've got my t-shirt on from ELR Style. And because this is so compressing and like smooths me in all the right places, it looks really good with the jeans. And it can also be dressed up with the black heels, which I've put here. And then I've just put it on with a blazer. So I think these jeans, one, will be great in summer. They'll go, they'll be like a really nice dress kind of jean to wear with like nice tops and stuff. Or if you're somebody like me right now who wants to have like a dinner and drinks jean, then this is definitely it. I feel like it looks, it like makes the t-shirt look more dressy, if that makes sense with the heels. It works with the blazer and a nice handbag. So yeah, I think I'll definitely be keeping these because I just like the color of them. And like I just said, I feel like they will work all year round, which is very hard to find with a good jean to make the color work work in winter and in summer. But yeah, I actually really like these. The only thing that's annoying me is that my foot with the length of the jean keeps going underneath the heel. So when I'm walking, I'm like walking on the jean. I feel like that's just, you know, from the front, they look great. It's just at the back. That's a my height problem, not a you guys trying these jeans problem. So I think these are also a hit. Then there's a few other bits that haven't arrived in time. I'm still gonna link them down below and I'm probably gonna feature them on shorts, TikToks and Instagram reels. Um, so if you haven't already follow me on all of those other channels as well um, and they should be coming up soon for some different ideas in case you did want to shop any of those looks I did today or any of the bits that I didn't get a chance to try because they didn't get delivered in time slash them and stole them so <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this video and if you haven't seen any of the other videos I've done recently I've done a boohoo haul I have done new look over autumn Gymshark Black Friday sale ones which have got some really great bargains in from Gymshark I've done some ELA style basic ones how to wear them Christmas party outfits everything is down below in the description if you want to watch any more of my videos from this season and if you haven't already please give this video a thumbs up and I will catch you in the next one thank you so much for watching bye